Hello and welcome. Today I have with me Lillian Worker on net. How are you? I'm doing good right now. Yeah, I'm I won my first uh, TMCL match, so yeah, I'm doing good. Yeah. Uh, but I wanted to start uh, by moving TMCL aside for a second and uh, talk to you about your retirement for uh, for for uh, for a minute. At the beginning of last year, you have announced that you are leaving TMGL circuit, so also TMGLC and OGL. You had your reasons that you laid out in Tweet Longer. Now with that time perspective, could you speak more about what you were feeling and what pushed you to the decision of uh, leaving this circuit? Mm, I think uh, I was kind of like upset of my, of my uh, level on Trackmania. Uh, I think it was a a good time to 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 get some more more work at school and uh, yeah um, the the main the main reason that uh, I left uh, uh, this circuit was uh, was that uh, I didn't want to play uh, at high level anymore mm -hmm. like I was just waiting the 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 ZLT Trackmania Cup for uh, for Bercy. And I didn't actually. I didn't expect to to step in to step up in TMGL. So yeah, I was just uh, I was just waiting for Bercy, and yeah, it was a, it was a, a a nice a nice moment to do it. I think so. Yeah, I I decided that. Mm -hmm. But that that's the thing, like because something changed along the way throughout this whole year that made you come back to, well, TMCL at the moment. Uh, what was that? Was it just the format or did you have like change of heart that you now want to compete at the high level? What happened? Um, yeah, the format uh, changed uh, a lot of things uh, in my mind. Like uh, playing with a friend was was something that I liked on uh, the ZLT Trek Mania Cup, obviously. And uh, I also uh, had uh, more time to play video games at home, uh, less uh, time to 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 homework uh, for school. So yeah, I uh, I would like to to play uh, with 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 a friend. I I think I won't uh, play this league uh, if it wasn't with a, a friend. Mm -hmm. Because uh, I don't see uh, any any uh, um, any goals uh, with without a, a friend. So yeah, with Coco right now, I'm super happy, and uh, I hope we will uh, get uh, nice results. Mm -hmm. And uh, I was meaning to ask you, like, how did you find your way to Easy Dream, and how is it was, and, and how easy, no pun intended, was actually to find a team in the first place? Was it always going to be Easy Dream, or were you looking for other options with Coco, or maybe alone? Um, at the beginning, I said to Snow and Coco, uh, if you do not have a mate, then I, I can be there. I can mm -hmm. be there for you. And I know that Snow um, already chose Glast, mm -hmm. but Coco was uh, in discussion with uh, Miquatro. Uh, but uh, yeah, uh, he decided to play it with me, uh, maybe because uh, he he feels it better than with Miquatro. I actually don't know why he, he chose me, mm -hmm. but yeah, maybe for. Uh, maybe since we are friends or something so yeah it wasn't that hard to 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 join a, to join the team mm -hmm. and would you be re were you ready to play regionals if it didn't work out to join TMCL or weren't or you weren't ready for that i don't think so i think uh i would not play uh, uh regional yeah it's, regionals, it's the yeah. name now mm -hmm. yeah Regionals now. Uh, I would only play uh, TMCL or TMGL, but uh, TMGL uh, wasn't uh, wasn't uh, a possibility for me. So yeah, when when I had this uh, this option in TMCL, I I just uh, went uh, straight to the goal. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You 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 are in TMCL right now. You're coming back with the new format, 
And immediately with a quite convincing win against the uh, Exalty, a team with uh, against a team with veterans of TMCL. Um, how did that feel? Actually, I'm not satisfied of my performance. Mm -hmm. Like uh, I played so badly. I I mean, like yeah, it was not a good match for me. I was a little bit stressful. I don't know why actually, because uh, I already played uh, uh, matches like that. But yeah, I maybe that wasn't the the day uh, to to perform. But uh, with Coco, we had a a, a super uh, a super feeling uh, uh, during the match. Like we we were uh, we were in synergy. I don't know if uh, mm -hmm. it exists in, in English. Yeah. 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 Um, yeah. We we have done uh, the the call uh, like uh, your po your point uh, one behind and uh, like that. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, yeah, it was really good, uh, really good uh, match with Coco. But uh, in terms of performance, I think I will have to step up for next week uh, against uh, Sprout. Mm -hmm. and, uh, because you said last time you you left because you weren't happy with your results, the, your motivation dipped down because of this. And well, now it was just only one match. Of course, it it doesn't impact you that much. But if it keeps up, like, do you feel like Coco is that support that gives you that will give you the motivation to go forward? And how does that relation work with you guys? Um, actually, since it, this format is in duo, uh, mm -hmm. it brings me a lot of mo motivation. Like, I'm not playing just for myself. I'm playing for myself and my teammate. So when my teammate. Uh, is uh, not at a night level i have to to motivate him and uh, uh the, the 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 same uh, with me so yeah uh, i i prefer to play uh, high uh, high tournaments uh with someone i i think i can't play uh, a solo uh, uh, tournament and uh, keep the motivation uh, at the at the max level i need someone to 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 step me up all right uh so coming right into the league how uh, after a break you've said not the best performance but how confident are you in your individual skills and also as a team you already get one win out of seven so start is good um in terms of uh, personal best on maps we are doing really good so i'm quite confident uh in, in, for the next matches uh, so it will just be a, a momentum, a momentum uh, with Coco. Like I know we can do uh, uh, huge matches, like uh, uh, I've done in the uh, in the finals of uh, Gamers Assembly. Like I, I, I'm sure we can do uh, a good stuff, but uh, uh, I hope we'll not play like uh, against Exalty because it wasn't really, really a good match for us uh, people were saying that the super week of TMGL might help TMCL players to prepare better for their first match day did watching TMGL help you find some things that you were missing before and help you in your preparations yeah yeah actually on the on the agility dash uh, we didn't know the strategy where you have to to take some uh, some heist uh, before uh, speed drift uh, mm -hmm. a section so yeah i actually uh, uh, took this uh, took this uh, strategy and uh, uh, it uh, helped me a lot uh, uh, so for glass which had uh, uh, really, really uh, difficult on uh, on this part because we are training with snow and glass. Mm -hmm. And uh, after the two first TMGL steps, so Saturday and uh, Sunday, uh, we joined the club with uh, Binks, Gwen, Bren, and Otak. So uh, we can play against the, the their ghost. So it's really helpful for doing great times. Like I've done a, um, a personal best on freestyle, which I I'm sure I I couldn't do without. So yeah, it it's really helpful. Mm -hmm. This is very interesting to hear, uh, the inner, uh, well alliances a little bit, uh, who's working with who. That's very interesting. As you said, uh, the first uh, match wasn't the best of your performances. 
and uh, well i think that i also think that wasn't the cleanest of matches although it was quite convincing a 4-0 uh, not 4-0 4-1 uh but having that in mind it wasn't the cleanest uh, so what do you think you you need to work on individually but also as a team um on the first match we knew what exalty uh, picked uh, before the match and what exalty uh, banned so we only trained on the on the um, on the maps we we know that we we will play but for the next yeah yeah <laughs> it can be surprising but yeah we 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 knew uh, just uh, not because someone told, told us uh, just mm -hmm. because we we this was quite logic since okay. they are both uh, tech players Mm -hmm. But we did not expect to beat them on their maps. So for the next week, uh, next weeks maybe, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, we uh, should play all the maps seriously. Um, and now I entered into a new, uh, new uh, training format. Like I'm doing four run with at the same time, or I don't skip. Like I. I'm trying on a, uh, on a, uh, oh, what's the name map? Uh, ah, the flip of face. I'm, I'm convincing myself to do uh, four times in a row, uh, one, uh, 1.04 time, or I don't skip. Like, oh, okay. I don't know if you see. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm doing this on all the maps to, to get a, um, a consistency on the, on the whole maps. So yeah, I think it can can be a great strategy. Yeah, that's uh, that that sounds uh, like a good strategy for training for uh, for consistency, uh, for sure. For a second, you you kind of sounded like you you got some leaks for the pick and bounce, <laughs> but I guess okay, it was it just it was just more of a gut feeling yeah. and uh, yeah, yeah, that's it. Knowing the the enemy, the opponent. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, well, your next matchup is against Sprout, commonly recognized as the best or the second best team uh, in TMCL. Well, after the, uh, the, this, uh, this match against Atax, uh, they might be the second best, actually. We don't know, but we don't know. Maybe they will uh, ramp up a little bit throughout the, uh, throughout the uh, season. But what do you think of them after seeing that uh, first match? What was your first impression? Um, I guess they are favorite against us, but we can, on a on a good day, beat uh, them on their maps. Like we know we have good points with Coco on uh, on on uh, some maps, and they have bad points on our maps. So we can, yeah, we can maybe sort out uh, a win against them. Uh, you have like uh, also like that feeling. I mean, you've seen one uh, w one draft already, but you you got that feeling. What what they will be picking against you too? Or or not not as much as Exalty. I I was actually surprised that they picked only tech maps. Like they didn't pick, uh, uh, I will say a, a mixed or uh, zealotry style maps. Mm -hmm. And I was yeah really surprised of that, but uh, no, we we just train uh, the the the, mm -hmm. the nine maps because we we already have our ban yeah but uh, yeah not the same as uh, as uh, last week. So confidence at level like five or six. So how do we? Uh, how do we go into this match? What do you think? Uh, what's the outcome, or maybe what's like the the score at the end? Will it be will it be close or not really? Um, I hope <laughs> it will be a stomp for us. But uh, yeah, if I want to be uh, to be objective, I think it will be a close match. Close match because. Uh, they they can they they will beat us on uh, on their picks i think and we will beat them on our pick but yeah it would be uh, maybe a, a 4 2 or 4 3 uh, map, mm -hmm. uh, match we're hoping for 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 threes as always those are the most exciting <laughs> yeah. 
So yeah, like yesterday. Yeah, like yesterday. So yeah, it was interesting. That was that was really crazy, right? <laughs> But thank you very much for the interview. Do you have any short message for the fans? Uh, yeah. Thanks for the the support that you bring us, and uh, yeah, I hope we'll uh, we will. Uh, We will do uh, good things on this season and maybe on the on the next season. So yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you all. And to all the viewers, you can find all the links to workers' socials in the description. Thank you very much for watching. And if you enjoyed, I invite you to leave a like and subscribe for more interviews in the future. Thank you very much.